Asian shares ended slightly higher, whilst US stocks ended flat as lackluster corporate earnings and a slowdown in China further dampened investors' confidence. The Dow closed at 17745 and the S&P 500 was hardly touched at 2108. The dollar crept down against the end to 124.030 after touching its highest level since June 2010. Crude oil dropped for the second session in a row as the OPEC head stated that production would not be cut back and the concern over global supply, supply gripped the industry. US crude was trading at $48 a barrel. London Copper too was facing its biggest monthly loss since January amid sputtering Chinese demand and strong dollar. It set for a 9% slump over July, its weakest showing since January and the second worst performance since 2012. The stronger dollar has also pushed down gold, which is on track for a six straight weekly fall, its longest drop since 99. Within the equity space, Lloyds Bank and Group posted a 15% increase in underlying first half profits to 4.4 billion and 38% increase in statutory profits to 1.2 billion. The stock was down 1% in early trade. There is EU CPI data at 10 a.m., Canadian GDP at 1.30. The FTSE has opened up 9 points at 6.633 and the DAX is up 44 points at 11287. Thanks for watching.